Hello, friends. Hey there, it's Sammy back with another episode of The Daily Dash. That's right, it's everything you need to know from around the world and in my life, straight from my car dashboard to yours. Today is Friday. Friday. I don't even know my Friday dance, but it's Friday. Friday, June 30th, 2017, which I thought it was July 1st. I was thinking it was like June leap year or something. Uh, let me tell you what you need to know so you're in the know around the water cooler and in car line today. All right, so President Trump is firing off ridiculousness on Twitter again, attacking two cable news hosts and um, huge backlash going on. Plus, a revised version of his travel ban went into effect today. Um, Jay-Z dropped his 11th studio album, 444. Yeah. I was on TRL once on MTV. That's like how far back I go with music. And, um, oh, Venus Williams is being, I don't know, held liable, but found, how do we say it? She was involved in a car crash. An elder gentleman died, and um, basically they're saying it was her fault. So I don't think any charges have been pressed, but that's interesting, obviously, especially a few days before Wimbledon. Um, and right where I was just driving a few days ago, too, down in Palm Beach Gardens. So that should put you in the know. I'm sorry I'm in my car. I know this is where I normally do the Daily Dash, but usually when I do talk of the town, can you see? Let's hear it. your studio tour. I should take my hand up. There you go. Your news and information later. There's your studio tour that you get today. I do this in the studio. But I did a recipe today, which is always a little stressful for me because it's a lot of moving parts. And it was a frozen segment, frozen dessert recipes. So no chance to do the daily dash, but it was delicious. So if you missed the segment or if you don't live in Nashville, you need to head to sammycone.com or I'm going to link it below. If you're watching on Facebook, if you're watching on YouTube, you can follow me at the Sammy Cone on Twitter or Instagram. I've got a couple links below. So easy dairy-free dessert recipes featuring this abundance of summer fruit. This all started when I found this huge bunch of bananas for 44 cents at Aldi that was, I mean, 44 cents. So I created this one ingredient, banana frozen yogurt or ice cream. It doesn't matter because there's no ice cream or yogurt in it, but it's great. So that led me to make smoothie bowls. That led me to make popsicles. So much fun stuff. So it's all linked below or will be if you're watching live. Um, you got to check it out. All the, I mean, I didn't, all the berries were under $2. I know prices change, but it was really, um, yeah, good stuff and delicious. I can't believe I didn't think about how to make this before. So step-by-step -step directions, not that you need it. Slice bananas, freeze it, food processor, yum. Mix in stuff, good. Um, plus with the smoothie bowls, I found so many things at Aldi. I found um, flax seeds, I found chia seeds, I found hazelnut spread, um, a lot of organic, organic cinnamon and some cashew butter and a little bit of 100% maple syrup. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. So that was delish. So that's what's going on. Okay. I, hey Candace. So I've got to go pick up kids now. Karis is babysitting. Britton is doing swim team. I'm going to do that and go unpack. Everything's probably turning into frozen mush back there. Okay, I hope you guys have a great day wherever you are. Make sure you make it great and do not wait to tell someone you love how you feel about them. Bye, friends.